Internships have been a source of controversy lately as many are beginning to question whether interns deserve to be paid when fighting each other for their boss's amusement. Chad Williams has more. Getting coffee, taking notes at meetings, beating each other senseless before crowds of cheering executives. The jobs of the intern aren't always glamorous, but many young people say that they're essential to getting ahead in a competitive job market. I'm doing it for the experience. I feel like if I can make myself useful and win a lot of fights, they might keep me in mind if there's an opening. Here at Slash Forward Marketing's New York office, unpaid interns like Lauren Howard are given the opportunity to punch, kick, and choke one another in front of supervisors with years of experience in the fields they hope to go into themselves. But should interns be paid? Human resources managers like Amanda Duell don't think so. She says this is just how young people earn their place in today's corporate environment. Our interns get real-world experience that looks great on the resume, and in return, we get a little extra help around the office and something fun to gamble on. But more and more critics are saying that internships have grown exploitative. George Berman, a labor lawyer, says that while a certain amount of blood sport is permitted under federal wage laws, all internships must be primarily educational. We're not saying that employers can't ask interns to stomp on someone's throat or make copies, but when interns do nothing all day but answer phones and close windows on each other's heads. They're just being taken advantage of. The question of pay has grown more contentious as internships have popped up seemingly everywhere, from small businesses to major corporations, all the way up to the White House. Landing one of these coveted positions has become so competitive that just last year, an unpaid internship at Viacom drew over 10,000 applicants. But as lawsuits continue to crop up, will unpaid intern fights become a thing of the past? For now, at offices like Slash Forward, it looks like they're not going anywhere. At the moment, I need experience more than I need money or 10 whole fingers, and I'm learning so much. I couldn't be happier. Uh, I used to be an intern. Now I'm a full-time employee, just like it's supposed to work. For the Onion News Network, I'm Chad Williams. Here at ONN, I like to treat our interns with respect because you never know if one day they'll be gambling on my pain.